Imagine the perfect start to your day. The sun is shining on your way to the office. You make yourself a strong cup of coffee. Sit down at your desk to check how many sales came in overnight. You log in into your website, only to find out that it's been compromised and you can't run your online business anymore. So now, what are you going to do? Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Well, you get it, don't you? It's all about backups today. And a very good solution, actually. Yeah, it's really good. And for this, we are going to use Block Vault. And as you can see, per their own website, they provide backups for business critical WordPress websites. And with their solution, you can recover your website within minutes from the worst disaster that may strike your WordPress site. And the best part, you can get started for free. So you can follow along with me right now. So create your account. And straight up from here, the first step is to add your website. So it couldn't be any simpler than this. So add website and I need to type the URL. So let's pretend this is our website. So in this case, this is an e-commerce website, but it could be any type of website, obviously. So let's fetch the URL. So I'm going to fetch the URL right here. So control C, go back here, control V and then continue. And now we need to sync our two websites. So for this, we need to install a plugin. So there are different ways of doing so. Number one here, as you can see, they can do it for us. All we have to do is to enter our credentials. So the admin login credentials, so your email address and your password. And once you click submit, this will be done automatically for you. Now, if you prefer not to use this method, you can do it manually as well. In which case, simply download the plugin and then install it manually on your website. So clearly method number one is the easiest one. And if you are worried about security, as you can see, we never store your WordPress admin credentials. They will be discarded immediately after the plugin is installed. So if you're not an experienced WordPress user, you might want to use the auto install plugin feature here. In our case, I'm going to show you how to install it manually. So simply download this on your hard drive. Now go to your WordPress dashboard, go to the plugin section, add new plugin upload plugin and select the file we just downloaded so choose file and then select the zip file open and then install and now activate plugin and now we need to log in to our block vault account as you can see it says wp remote don't worry it's a subdivision of block vault is the same company and for this simply use the same credentials you use on the block vault website so enter your credentials email address and password and then sign in and as you can see, you'll be redirected to the screen and immediately it will start syncing our website. So this might take a little while. And there you have it, guys. You can see the sync was completed and now we can have a quick look at the site overview. So at the moment, we have a green mark. As you can see, sync successfully completed, real-time security enabled and no malware detected. So this is the beauty of Block Vault. Not only will you get backup, but also full security built in. So let's have a quick look, okay? So let's visit the site overview. And from here, you will find all sorts of information. So generic information like which PHP version is installed, which WordPress version are we using, how many plugins are installed, themes and users. But most importantly, it's on this side, guys, okay? So as you can see, you have different features available and different services provided by the one solution, which is Block Vault. As you can see, you have backup. You also have security and firewall. You can create staging environments. You can also manage your plugins, your themes, and your WordPress installation in general right here from the same screen. And if you scroll down, even down to the performances, if your website doesn't perform in Google PageSpeed Core, you can also install Airlift and speed it up to get near to 100 score. And then a few additional sets of information, such as advanced monitoring, Google Analytics, and also form testing if you have any forms installed on your website. So clearly, this is a very comprehensive solution. So the one we are interested in and we are going to focus on today is the backup feature. So let's pretend that our website was compromised or perhaps hacked or something like this. So disaster strikes. What is the next step? OK, so to demonstrate this, let's go back to the front end to our website and let me refresh. So as you can see, our website is healthy and working absolutely fine. Now, like we said, imagine if disaster strikes, what will happen then? So I'm going to sabotage this website on purpose. I'm going to go to appearance. I'm going to go to the theme file editor. 
And then this is basically the main file, the function.php. I'm going to say everything, delete, and then update file and see what happens next. And we're now getting this error message. There has been a critical error on your website. Well, clearly because we deleted one of the main files. And now clearly you can't access your website from the front end or the back end. If I refresh now, as you can see, you have a big error message as well. So imagine if you are in that situation. Oh, what a disaster. So what do you do next? Well, don't worry. The panic is over because help is at hand. Just go back to your Block Vault account, log in, go to your sites, select your own website. So click on those six dots. And right here we have the backup feature. All you have to do is to click restore. So click on this magic button here and then you can restore your website to a previous point in time. So as you can see, we have the latest backup we had. Now you can select another one if you wanted to, but normally you would select the latest version unless this version was already compromised, obviously, you know. So right here you have the selective restore. And then depending on the case scenario, you want to restore your files or database or both. So in our case, obviously, we want both of them restored. And then you have a few advanced options as well. And from here, depending on the hosting provider you're using, you might have to enable the file permissions as well. In our case, we don't need it. And then after this, all you have to do is click continue. There you go, as you can see, it's gonna start restoring our website. And there you go, as you can see, our website has been fully restored. So now let's go back to the front end and put this to the test, okay? So we go back to our homepage, refresh. There you go, this is working again. And let's go back to the back end, our WordPress admin dashboard. And there you go, our website is back up and running. So as you can see, this is very effective indeed. Now again, Block Vault is a comprehensive solution. It's not just the backup. You also have your security, as you can see. You also have the possibility to create a staging environment, make sure that everything is up to date. And as you can see, you can add multiple sites. So if you own multiple sites, you can manage them all from the one dashboard. So you could be maybe a freelancer or a web agency, or maybe a business owner, entrepreneur with multiple websites. This is an all-encompassing solution that will help you manage multiple websites from the one dashboard. So how much does it cost in the end? Well, let's go to their pricing structure. As you can see, it starts from 149 US dollars per year, which is quite affordable based on the amount of services provided. So what's included for 149, one backup per day, secure cloud storage, one-click restore, one-click migration, and centralized updates and 24 export response times. So all of this is included. Now, obviously, as you go up in price, there are additional features added to it as well, including the backup frequency. As you can see, for 199, you get two backups per day, 299, four backups per day, and 499, it's a backup every single hour. So depending on the type of business that you run, I think, to be honest, even 499 is not even that expensive considering that you get a backup every single hour. Now, I hope you found this video helpful. If so, don't forget to give me a like, subscribe, and also share with all of your friends whom you think might be interested in this tool as well. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.